Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to learn implementation of simple switch case. Uh, so where you are trying to do addition, subtraction, multiplication, modular division and the normal division. Right. So for this, we require two operands that is N1 and N2. And then uh, how uh, for switch case, you will pass a character that is oper operator value. So that one I'm taking uh, in the form of a uh, string. Right. So I had declared it as a character, but when you're trying to take that single, single value, you can take it as a S by S you can take. Okay. So if you'll take C, uh, sometimes it is not accepting. So it is better if you'll take S. Right. So, yeah. So we'll start with our program. Hash include stdivo.h. Then we are starting with your main. And then I said, no, one operator. Uh, so for that operator, I had given the value as operation. I mean, variable name as operation. And then two variables I want, N1 and N2. Uh, so those are the two operands, right? So if I give 12 and 3, in N1, you will have 12. And in N2, you will have 3. And after reading those two values, it, you, it will ask user to enter what is his choice. That is what operation he wanted to do, addition, subtraction, or multiplication. So depending on the choice, uh, it will switch to that particular block. If suppose I'll give plus, right? So switch operation. So in this operation, you'll have this one plus. So switch plus, where is the plus? So in the case plus, so here is my symbol, operator symbol, right? So that one, uh, that if you'll give plus, you will directly move to this particular case and you will perform the addition. If I give minus, you will come to the subtraction case. If I'll give multiplication, you will come to the multi multiplication case. Modular division, you will move on to the modular division. If division, you will come to the normal division. If I'll give some other which is not there in my program, that is some other different operand, then it will tell an error uh, message. That is your default message. Error operator is not correct. So what we are trying to do, we are trying to do only addition, subtraction, multiplication, division, and the modular division. Other than that, if you will give any other operator, you should get some message, right? So for that reason, you'll be using the default default case so the default case you'll just give a simple message and then finally you'll come out of the switch case and the main okay so this is what is happening and if you'll just closely observe i had given here two modular symbols because you in the output screen you need to print the modular if you give a single modular symbol your compiler will think that it has a um, some escape sequence right so that is the reason you need to give two percentile symbols uh, when you are trying to print the percentile symbol onto your output screen right so just simple one this is already we had seen in our uh, theoretical lectures so right so we'll just compile and execute the program once right so yes let us compile no errors and then run enter two operands i wanted to give 10 and two so it is asking for you to enter the operator sorry operator whatever you want i'm just giving plus symbol so 10 plus 2 is 12 so in the similar fashion if all the operators will work okay so same 10 and 2 i now i wanted to do the subtraction so 10 minus 2 is 8 and if you wanted to do the multiplication, again, you just go back, run it. Um, I want 10 into again, simple multiplication symbol. You'll get 20. If I give some other operand, what will happen? We'll see. Run it again. Uh, now I'm giving uh, just a hash symbol. Sorry, two operands they asked, right? 10, 2. I'm giving just a hash symbol. See, error operator is not correct. So like that, you will get a default message when you are trying to give the operator, which is not there in our program, right? So addition already, you know, subtraction already, you know. So I'm not going to give a complete uh, picture of what is addition. Again, you're adding to N1 and N2 and that is stored into another variable. All the basic things, you know. So that is the reason I was just giving a direct uh, program for this uh, switch case okay so the theoretical part we had discussed in our uh, theoretical uh, switch case uh, switch case related program 
there also we had seen one uh, program with this same switch case operation okay so you can go to uh, go through that one for theory of the switch case operation okay right so that's all for this video thank you everyone